Hey Disney fans, welcome back to my channel. It is that time again. It is what is in my Disney pin bag Wednesday and we're gonna have some fun. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna pick out two just like normal and if it ends up being three, then it ends up being three. So I'm gonna go ahead here. You can see still lots to go through. So I'm gonna pick out one, there's one. I'm gonna pick out another one. There's two. Yeah, I think that'll be good for today. So let's go ahead and get this zip back up and, and then let's see what is in these ones. So they are both, <laughs> well, I actually grabbed two from the same Instagram seller. So these are both from Young Queen Disney Pen. So I will of course show you the business card that's always sent with these. I do not know what's in here, but there is some fun things. So first things first, let's go ahead head and uh yeah this looks like a fun one i got my scissors this time so i am prepared last time i think i forgot them i had to run and grab them um she does some really great live sales on instagram super super fun this first one here is all kinds of cool <laughs> this is a disneyland resort annual pass holder 2005 pin i don't believe it's limited edition oh no it is Limited edition of 5,000. And this pin is so much fun. I absolutely love it. So again, annual pass holder, 2005. You can see there it is Stitch dressed up as Tinkerbell, but Stitch moves. So I think that's really fun. You can see there like he's, you know, dousing the, the castle in some fairy dust. On the back, you can see there at the bottom, it does say limited edition of 5,000. This is such a fun little pin. It says, Magical Milestones, a pin celebration. So cool, yeah, and again, pass holder exclusive. So this was on one of her pin boards and I thought, golly, that's just too cute. It's a little bit smaller than I thought it was gonna be, but nonetheless, I still love it. I love the little, the little moving stitch part there. That is a lot of fun. It did come on its original backer card, so that's kind of fun. I'm gonna go ahead and slap that back on there and find the back because I just dropped it. There we go. Okay, so right off the top, not bad. Let's see what else we've got in here. I'm gonna try and find the business card. She usually always puts one in. There it is. Okay, so she usually includes the business card with a couple of the smaller pins uh, and then puts it in this really nice little baggie. So again, go out to Young Queen Disney Pins. Make sure to follow her Instagram page. They do live sales, I believe, every Wednesday. So there'll be one tonight. Um, I think and uh, yeah, lots and lots of fun. They do games. They do giveaways um, Great pin prices. They do pin boards plus what they call peekaboo pins Which are just quick little showings of a little bit more expensive or pricier pins But and then of course along in with that business card. There were two other pins. So let's go ahead and see What those two other pins were and I Can't tell what this one is. So let's get it open here Maybe Okay, oh yeah. Okay, so this is a 2004 pin, so it's older. Also limited edition. I'm gonna get the price sticker off of it here so we can actually see the back, maybe. Wow, that price sticker is stuck. There we go. Okay, so this is limited edition of 750 2004 lights, camera, pins. Um, this looks like it was Disney MGM Studios, so obviously an old pin, but you can see there it's got all the princesses on it, up to that point, of course. So, uh, and then the little pin on pin design there uh, is the lights, camera, pins, 2004. So there's Jasmine, Aurora, Cinderella, Sleeping Beauty, Belle, and Ariel. And of course I bought it because Cinderella and Ariel are on it. And, uh, oh, there's no, oh, and Snow White, of course. But um, absolutely love that pin. A little bit of glitter embellishment in the star and the spotlight there that's coming through. Super fun pin. I completely forgot all about that one. <laughs> Shh, don't tell anybody. There's one more pin in that little packet there. And, oh yes. This was a fun little $10 pin. So, um, I am weird. Like, I, I have my main collection, which of course are Snow White, Sleeping Beauty, or Snow White, Cinderella, and Ariel. Then I have all these little side collections like of Cyan Am because I have a Siamese cat and I love the Cyan Am pins. Um, I've got one of 
the Blue Fairy, which is exactly what this one is, and this is gorgeous. Let me take the little price tag off here again. This one, let me see here. Uh, gift with purchase, 2007 Disneyland Resort. Old waffle back pen, it's beautiful. A lot of glitter embellishments and, and really just a gorgeous, gorgeous pen. So I love most of the Blue Fairy pens that are out there. I think they've all done a really good job with them. Um, it's just absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. But oh yeah, love that pen. So that is it for that little packet that had the card in there. There are still, however, a couple of pins in the bag. So let's take a look. Oh yes. Okay, fun stuff in this little bag too. Get it open here. Pins out. There looks like to be three pins in this one. Okay, so oh, oh, oh. yes, I was. I knew I had this one. I've been waiting to come across it because I want to put it on my pin board. So it is another just old Disney waffle back. It is Ariel the Little Mermaid 2002. So an old pin, but oh, I dropped it. Oh, it is Ariel in her wedding dress. Not limited edition or anything like that, but just, of course, when I needed to have her dress. I don't know if my camera's gonna pick it up well or not, but there is glitter embellishment in her dress and just a beautiful, beautiful pin. I have this Cinderella one, and I know somewhere I've got the Snow White one, so I needed this one for my Ariel pin board, and this one was all of like 15 bucks, so I didn't think that was too bad. Obviously an older pin, you can see there, I'll show you the back. It is the old waffle back, old, old, old style, uh, style pin. Love, 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 love that pin, so cool. And then there's two more little pins in that same little packet. Let me get them open here, and they look like they might be a little bit older pins too. Let's get that first one out. Okay, so this pin's a little creepy, I'm not gonna lie, but you'll know why I got it here in a second. Just another old waffle back pin but it is a dancing Snow White. And um, she looks a little funny, but she goes with this pin here, which let me open that up and then I think it'll make more sense. Let's see here, they tape these things so well. Alrighty, okay, so these go together. So when you hold them together, Snow White is dancing with Dopey. And I don't remember who was at the bottom, Doc or Grumpy or somebody, but these two pins obviously are a set and go together. And I think I paid $10, something like that, for the set. So not bad, not bad at all. Two beautiful little pins. So super excited about those ones. Those will get added to my Snow White board. And there's one more pin in this little packet here. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, 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 yes. This is another one I've been waiting to get out of here because I knew I bought it. I've just been waiting for it. This is a limited edition Disney Parks. $14.95 was the original retail. I think I paid $20 for it. Uh, 25th anniversary limited edition of $2,000. There is something on this. Let me see if I can get that off. There we go. Um, oh, this is so beautiful. 25th anniversary of The Little Mermaid. And it's got a spinner element here. I'm gonna hold it by the back, you can see. So one side says 25th anniversary, the other side says The Little Mermaid. So this pin is about five years old because this is the 30th anniversary now of Ariel. Let me see, yep, 2014, limited edition 2000. So it is pin on pin with a spinner element. You can see there's Ursula putting on lipstick or eating the shrimp. I can't quite tell what she's doing there. Ariel looking at flounder. I love, 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 love this pin. It did come on its original backer card, so that's awesome. Let me put that beast right back on there. That was a great bag. Holy smokes, lots of goodies. Lots of ones I've been waiting on. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get into this next bag here. Again, this is also from Young Queen Disney Pin, so I'm not gonna bother showing you the business card because it's the exact same. But of course, that's the first one I pulled out. Um, gotta watch the time. There's a new Funko dropping at one o'clock today. Or yeah, 11, well, it's 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, so. Let's see, yeah, that'd be two o'clock my time. So I got like 10 minutes, I'm so excited. But anyhow, bunch of little pins, yay! Oh good, lots of tape, that means. Ugh. All right, so let's get this one undone here. Oh, yes. Uh, 
I'm not, but this one says I'm really a mermaid. <laughs> this is just an open park pin. Um, I love this pin. I obviously cannot go to the park all the time. And I saw this on one of her pin boards and I screamed sold because I've wanted it since I saw it. And it's so pretty. It's aerial and I love it. It's got a really pretty, like almost looks like floating enamel in the back with some glitter on it. Um, beautiful pin. Let me get the price sticker off here and then maybe I can see when it came out. Oh, well, maybe it's not open edition, it's 2016. It might still be in the parks, I have no idea. I did not see it when I was there in December. So if it is still in the parks, guys, definitely leave a comment below. So that's the first pin out of that little batch. And now I've got a bunch of other little teeny tiny pins. I'm trying to see if I can see what it, I don't know what it is. No idea. This is gonna be like Christmas all over again for me. Oh, right, okay. So this was the Walt Disney Collector's Society pin. Um, just an old waffle back. Get the price to drop it. It's not limited edition or anything like that that I'm aware of. It's from 2007, and it is a member exclusive pin, and it's got Cinderella in it on it. And this is when she's, of course, in her uh, little cleaning outfit, and it says Walt Disney Society Collection there. I love this pin. Of course, got this for my Cinderella pin board. So we'll put that there. And now I got another little tiny pin bag. Man, I got a lot in this one. I'm excited because there's still more in here. All right, let's see here. Oh, yay, 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 yay. Okay, I have a tiny, 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 tiny side collection of Zootopia. But I don't have Judy Hopps, just Judy Hopps. So now I do. <laughs> so here is Judy Hopps. I think this was from a um, parks pack maybe like a booster set or something. Um, doesn't really say. And the, the thing on the back is so tiny, it's hard to read. But yes, so now I've got a Judy Hopps. I'm thrilled, I love Judy Hopps. Zootopia, I bought it for my kids and didn't watch it. And then I watched it finally and I love that movie. I absolutely love Zootopia. So I'm like, I need to get myself some Zootopia pins. So now I have a couple and here is the one that goes with that. I'm so excited. It is Nick Wilde. Again, I think this is from one of those booster packs here, starter packs you can get in the parks. But there is Nick, and he will sit right alongside Judy. And I'm gonna have to get a little mini penny board just for those guys, because I've got another set coming <clears throat> of Zootopia pins. <laughs> All right, so let's see here what the final one in that little packet was. Ooh. Oh, that's right. Okay, this pin is gorgeous. This pin is absolutely gorgeous. I don't remember what it's from. It doesn't even have a copyright Disney on the back, so it's probably not even, like, I don't even know where this came from. Well, copyright Disney's on the front. If you guys know something about this pin, let me know. It has floating enamel covering it. It's pin on pin, glitter embellishment, and it's beautiful. It's a little mermaid. Ariel is the pin on pin design. The back is probably one of the weirdest backs I've ever seen, but I absolutely adore this pin. It was not a bad price. Um, a lot of people wanted it. I remember that on the live sale, but I was lucky enough to say sold first. So that is it for the little pack. I still have one more little wrap something in there. I think that was all of them. Yes. So, okay. Yep. One final pin. Wow. This was, well, you'll see. This was the night for Ariel. Look at this pin. This pin is from, golly, I don't even know when does not say Ariel's Undersea Adventure. It's pin on pin and I love it. Look at that pin, it's so beautiful. <sighs> I love Ariel. Between her and Snow White and Cinderella, I mean every day, every given day, it's always gonna be Snow White and then Ariel. But uh, yeah, see this is from 2013, I think is what that says. But there's the pin itself. It's so pretty in the back, oh my gosh. I love this pin. I have to, I, she's missing an arm though. That looks kind of weird without her other arm. I mean, it's obviously not missing it. It wasn't a defect in the pin or anything, but they only put one arm on the pin. So that's kind of weird. But anyhow, so yes, there is my final pin in today's What's in My Disney Pin Bag Wednesday. A uh, little mail opening here. What a group of amazing, amazing pins. I'm gonna turn that back to the side. Very excited, glad I got what I got and opened what I did because I've been waiting on some of these. So now I'm gonna be able to put them on my pin board and get the kind of collections even a little bit more consolidated. I really need to go through my pins. I have a ton, a ton. 
Anyhow, guys, so I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for tagging along. I do do a, I do do, I do a pin bag Wednesday video every Wednesday, hence the what's in my Disney pin bag Wednesday. Um, so I'll open up a couple, sometimes more than a couple little mailers that I've gotten over the past couple of months uh, of new pins for my Disney pin collection. And we do have a lot of fun seeing what it is because nine times out of 10, I forgot what I bought, which is really bad. And I have ended up with doubles because of that. But anyhow, guys, if that is your thing, make sure you smash that subscription button, hit that notification bell. We do try to post at least once a week, nine times out of 10. It's gonna be two to three times a week, if not more. We have a lot of fun on this channel, so I hope you do decide to join our channel. Don't forget, my giveaway is still ongoing for a few more days, and we're gonna draw three winners that will be done on YouTube. So again, make sure you watch that video. There are rules that have to be followed in order to be eligible. I hope you all are having a very magical day, and we will see you real soon. All right, one final thing, because this is awesome. One of my viewers, I am so honored. I actually got mail from a viewer, and this is huge for me because I am not what I, anyone would probably consider a very big channel on YouTube. There are people that have thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of more subscribers than I do. And I just figured I would never be one of those ones that actually got mail from a viewer, but I did. Um, they reached out to me on Instagram and asked uh, what my shipping address was. And they said they had a gift coming to me and it arrived in the mail today. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead here, find my scissors and I'm gonna open it. This gift came from Tyler and I will link to Tyler's channel in the uh, description below and <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, he sent me a t-shirt. Now our conversation makes so much more sense. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, I love it. Oh my gosh. Okay, now is my emotional side. He sent me the coolest t-shirt in the world. It is men's, it says men's, <laughs> well, not my size, I'm not gonna tell you my size because I think I'm fat. But look at this, oh my gosh. <laughs> this is the coolest t-shirt ever. Oh, I love it, oh my gosh. This is, I mean, minus of course the whoopsies tower that is on the um, VHS. This is the original, pretty much, uh, VHS holder, I guess, if you will, case that The Little Mermaid was released with. Oh my gosh, Tyler, thank you. You shouldn't have. Oh my gosh. <sighs> my day is good. <laughs> thank you so, so much, Tyler. I absolutely love, love, love this t-shirt. You have no, well, you do, I have an idea, I'm sure, because I post about Ariel all the time, but oh my gosh, this is the first Little Mermaid t-shirt I have. I've never had one before. Thank you again, Tyler. I cannot say thank you enough. I am honored. Have a great day, everybody.